Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. As usual, let's talk about Chanel 23A collection, the best and the worst bags. This collection will be released on June 12, 2023. We are mainly focused on seasonal bags. We will take a look at some bags that we can consider and some bags that I don't recommend. So let's start with the bag that you can consider. Top handle bag. This season, Chanel comes a couple of top handle bags with a different style. Some of them already in the boutique in some area and some country. Besides the seasonal top handle bags, they also come with the classic top mini rectangular bag. So if you don't like a seasonal bag, definitely go back to the classic one. I inserted some pictures from social media, so you can take a look at the detail of the handle. Next one is the flap bag. This season, not many flap bags that we can choose. I only picked a few of them. You guys can take a look. Next category is a hobo bag, shopping bag, and a bowling bag. The reason I put them as you can consider because I think those bags are more practical than tiny teeny bags. Those bags at least you can use as an everyday bag, work bag, or even weekend bag. They have a good capacity and they can put all your essentials. If money is not a big issue for you, then those are the bags that you can consider. Moving on, next one is a backpack. Chanel backpack are always very popular, and this time they come with a smooth calf skin leather instead of the caviar leather. But the brown color is so, so beautiful, very rich color. Next one is the buggy bag. This collection, Chanel has a new style of the buggy bag. As you can see, they add the extra pocket in front of the bag. I don't know how people reacted to this new style. Do you like it? Leave a comment below. So besides the leather version, they also come with the tweed material, which I don't recommend it. Because for the buggy bag, I think you will use very often. So if you choose the tweed material, the wear and the tear will show in very quick. So I don't think it's worth to buy it. Next one is the 31 bag. Chanel come back 31 bag after they discontinued on the 2020. And this time they come two sizes. The yellow one I believe is a mini and the black one is a large size. However, I only recommend you get the calf skin leather, don't get the pattern leather. Pattern leather need high maintenance. Next one, let's talk about the bags that I don't recommend. It. The first one is this flap bag. Now, if they don't put off a piece of the wood, I would think this will be very classic bag, but now they're adding this piece of the wood. 
I don't know. What do you think? Do you like the style? Do you feel this is too much? I feel this is very taggy. It doesn't look classic anymore to me. And the next one is even worse. It is in such funny contrasting. The chunky chin is just way too exaggerated. I feel it is so unbalanced of the bag. It just beyond me. Next one is a 22 bag. No matter what color they come out every season, no matter what style they come out, I never ever recommend you guys to buy this bag. Now I hear more and more people talking about their quality issues. I know this bag is getting more and more popular because I feel should not put a lot of resource to push this bag to the market. And、uh, since 2023, the spring summer collection, they come out the、uh, mini size. This bag become more and more popular. But I still want to you to keep in mind, you know, this bag, the price, the quality, just not worth to buy it. This bag called shopping bag. Because of the design, this bag costs a lot. So for shopping bag, I won't recommend you to buy this type of the bag. Next few bags has a vertical shape bag. Now for me, I feel the vertical shape bag are not very comfortable to use. Especially you try to reach something inside the bag, you need to dig all the way down to the bag. So it's not very convenient to use. Also,、uh, they come with the patent leather. I will never ever recommend you to buy patent leather. So the mini rectangular come out the pattern leather, and the thirty one bag also come with the pattern leather. I won't recommend it. The other bag I don't recommend it. Sorry, because of the material or because of the price tag. Next bag, I just quickly share with you some bags already in a boutique as a pre-launched. So you can check from your local boutique from now on. You know, sometimes they will come the stock earlier、uh, before the official launch day. So here are just for your information. And the final part are some. Small leather goods and some accessories. I hope you guys enjoy this video, and I will see you in the next video. Thanks.